Man, freaking food poisoning sucks. Let me tell you. By the way, what's up, guys? How are you guys doing? Um, I know it's been a bit since I live streamed. Like I said, I had some food poisoning on Friday night. And it just screwed up my entire schedule because I haven't been able to sleep or, well, not sleep properly. Finally, last night, I actually got a decent rest. Um, it's It's been really rough ever since Friday night. Like, spend the whole night throwing up and, you know, then you sleep kind of a little bit through the next day to kind of recoup a little bit but since i have kids they keep me up and you know i got to take care of them too so when my wife got home then i was able to get some rest but because i got a little bit of rest and i stayed up through the whole night saturday night it was a mess it was a mess guys so yeah that's that's what's been going on i kind of want to just update you guys on on things you know just with me with life i guess uh we um so on, what was it? I lose track of my time right now. Uh, yesterday, yeah, yesterday, we went to um, to the beach with the family because my family gets uh, gets condos on the beach every year. And um, and so we, we went spent some time with them yesterday. Uh, and then my wife and I were able to go to 8-Bit Hall of Fame, which is a store. It's a video game store that I did a video on Um a while back and I'll, I'll link the video for that so you guys can check that that out that store is freaking amazing but we had walked into the store and because uh, my wife had never been there and so I wanted to show her and so while um while we were there we went to because he has like he has different cases display cases where he has like the more expensive games and in one of the cases which is like kind of like the ps1 case deal um he's got like a whole mess of of ps1 games that are really like you know high price games like persona 2 um zeno gears uh i don't know if he has sui Koden, but you know you, you get the idea like he, he's got like you know the higher price games behind that that case uh you know locked up and uh in there was lunar lunar silver star story on the ps1 and um, those of you guys who are new to the channel, which there's a lot of people who are new to the channel, know my history, or you don't know my history with Lunar. Uh, those of you who are um, veterans of the channel at this point, you know, or maybe you don't, but you should know my history with Lunar. Uh, when I was younger, when Lunar came out on the PS1, I really wanted it, and my mom bought it for me uh, for, I think, my birthday or something like that. So my mom bought it for me. And I love the game. I played it nonstop, um, being it multiple times, and it was just one of my favorite games. And then I let a friend of mine, who I thought was a friend, I let him borrow the game. Just the game, but not the... Because my mom bought me the collection. It was a Lunar Silver Star, Silver Star Story Complete, so it's a collector's edition. And um, so I let him borrow the game. But, you know, obviously, I didn't give him the outer box. I didn't give him the, um, I didn't give him the collectible stuff. I just, I let him borrow the game. And then he never returned the game to me. And I kept asking for it, and he never returned it to me. I even asked his brother to get it for me, and his brother couldn't find the game. So I don't know if, uh, if the guy sold the game because he had some drug problems later on. So... Throughout the years growing up, I was on the hunt to buy Lunar again. Um, you know, buying it, and I actually ended up buying it multiple times. And multiple times, I ended up having to sell the game because I had to provide for my family because I maybe lost my job or whatever. So I had to sell Lunar uh, because, you know, it goes for a, a decently high price. And, um,. And one of the other things, too, is like I've never – hold on a second. One of the other things, too, is I, I never I, – I never got the set or the discs that I had um, for the original version of the game. So my um, – so when we were at 
Well, if you if you don't know, working designs a lot of times in some of their games they have different designs on their uh, on their games or on the discs. And so when we were over there, you know, I'm like, oh, can I see the can I see the lunar because I wanted to um, I wanted to see the discs, you know, to see if oh this is the this is the one I used to have. And um, so he's like, yeah, yeah. So he, the guy gets it for me, so that way I can take a look at it. And sure enough. It's the ones that I used to have. And so knowing my history with the game, knowing how much I like I really wanted this, my wife ended up buying the game for me after I told her she didn't have to. And she did, which was really cool. And it made my day. And I ended up crying numerous times yesterday. <laughs> but yeah, so, you know, they have a whole bunch of games over there that I want to kind of just like, mark off my checklist because i used to own them at one point or whatever but yeah that that's what's been going on lately or the past couple of days really not much just you know the whole food poisoning thing and then um and then me getting uh lunar but you know i'll, I'll be back to streaming regularly like i'd normally do uh just you know i got now i gotta catch up on the rest of life before i can actually do that uh, so, yeah, I just I just wanted to touch base with everybody, and um, I will catch you all later. You guys have a great rest of your day. Peace out, guys. I know a short video, but peace out, guys.